Greetings everyone. What I want to talk to you today is about a video I, I seen um, yesterday. And there was a lady from Norway on. And she was going on about how she would lived as a vulva for many years. And a whole family were vulva. Um, all the way down the generations. And she was invited to talk at a university. And um, what she was saying is she had all these academics there that had read loads of books and studied the Viking culture and history, studied all the eaters, studied everything for many, many years. And she says, and when she talked to them, she knew roughly nothing. Roughly what they did is copy down what was said in the sagas or the poetic era and give their interpretation of what that meant. Now she turned around and says to them is most of these writings um, were written hundreds of years after the event. She says things were struck passed down as an oral tradition. Things weren't wrote down. She says, so these people were Christians, or in one case, or two cases, Muslim, who wrote down the history many years afterwards. Now, most of us weren't around in the First World War. But if you had to write a story about the First World War, on what you could find written. There's an awful lot of the day-to-day -day life you would miss out on. Imagine you only could get your hands on 20 books on the First World War. That's it, 20 books. Do you think you could get the full history of the whole of the wars in that time? No. I mean, nowadays everyone reads and writes, so there's always books and that. But what this lady was saying is because she lived a life, she had a lot more knowledge of realism than the academics. Plus, as she says, our people are focused. So one town would be completely different from another town. So their vulva or their seer would treat people in a completely different way. Interesting. I mean, academics, fantastic. But still, people living with the oral tradition. Fantastic. Let's know what your thoughts are. I mean, I do like the academic work. I like to know things happened. But as she says, they were written hundreds of years afterwards by people that didn't know anything. Let's see what your thoughts are. Okay, blessed gods, everyone. Heal to you. Heal it. Bye.